You know, the one day that you just wish it was socially acceptable to walk around start by naked. Oh, Today no, is that day. <laughs> Enjoying the sun like this on Monday or Tuesday during the hottest part of the day just won't be possible as more stark warnings about the heat continue to come. The hottest day the UK has ever seen with temperatures getting up to 41 degrees in places. Parts of England have a red warning for extreme heat for the first time ever which means there's a danger to life. That's from Manchester and York down to London and the South East. There could also be big travel problems. We've been hearing how some of you are going to cope. Jono is a chef. Any time of year, it's, it's a red hot. You know what? Fire, gas stoves, fries, those grills and ovens. I think I'm going to go, Jim. <laughs> JTV today we are down at my beloved UFB Ultimate Fitness Birmingham testing out what the heat is like we're gonna be asking members we're gonna be asking guests their thoughts on the heat we're gonna be smashing a session with the boss man site as well so it's gonna be a good one drop a like comment down below subscribe if you are new I'm in vest shorts and sliders would I recommend this absolutely not do as I say not as I do stay safe stay hydrated it's gonna be a good one let's do this Started training yet? He's only just rocked uh, up. It's, it's nice to be inside. <laughs> Bring it on Vegas, bring on Texas, that's what I say. It's when you're trying to recover from a set, your heart rate goes up and you just like get the, the fodder sweat, you know what I mean? I don't know, it's it to be honest. <laughs> you're dealing with it a lot better than me, that's for sure. Mind you, you're off to Vegas where it's going to be 45, let alone 40. What do we think then, training in this heat? Beautiful, it's the best way. Better than cold, better than the snow, and you'll miss it when it's gone. Two up, mate, two up. It's lovely though, wicked. How are you feeling training in the heat? Not good. <laughs> Too hot, mate. <sighs> but get it done. Get it done. <sighs> One more. Press. Up. Up. <sighs> oh, yeah. So, what do you think training in the heat? Have you noticed it? Just a tad. I'm actually a bit chilly, though, you know? Chilly? Yeah, really. Really chilly. Can you close the windows then? Yeah, yeah, sure, I'm all mate, why not? <laughs> Get it, get it, get it, get it. Push it off, push it off. Very good. Pretty chilly. So, I've actually come to the gym a couple of hours earlier than I normally would, um, and it's actually 35 degrees right now. Um, I've come purposely earlier, to, to be honest. I'm not training in as much of the heat. Like, it's still gonna be hot, like, it's still 30 plus. Obviously, it's really freaking hot, but it's gonna get up to like 36, 37, 38 over the next couple of days. In here as well, the big, beautiful windows 
which makes filming so nice and training with a view quite nice it means it can get a little bit greenhousey in here. So, I'm not looking forward to it, but we'll see how we go. We're doing all right so far. I'm actually, I'm coping pretty, pretty, pretty well, I would say, all things considered. Uh, I'm Mohammed Chopsy. Um, I'm working out today in the heat. I've got to get the, the workout in regardless of the heat. So I'm training chest, uh, a bit of shoulders today as well. Uh, looking forward to it, but I've got to admit, it's baking in here. But, got your towel with you anyway. Yeah, yeah. Got the towel. Got to have that. Don't want to be uh, adding sweat to all the benches over here. So if you do train on a hot day, make sure you've got your towel with you. Otherwise, uh, so I will come after you. He's got his squash as well, but he's going to switch it for clear way. Yeah, I'm all right. Switching to uh, clear way soon. Thanks to thanks correct. To Good lad. Right. Enjoy your session. Enjoy your session. How are you finding the heat? I love it. We should get hotter. <laughs> I was promised melting roads and melting train tracks and all sorts and I haven't seen any of that yet so I'm a bit disappointed. To be honest, it wasn't actually planned to train with Sai today, to train with the boss man. Um, we're both here, we're both training push so we're doing it. But I'm quite glad because I feel like in this weather, if I was just training on my own, I would have just kind of gone through the motions. I would have done a bit of this and a bit of that. You know, I would have just gone a bit easy and just kind of cruised, but I'm feeling good because, to be honest, I've been on my stuff, on my shit a little bit more the past few weeks. And uh, I feel like you can tell, or I can tell anyway, maybe you guys can't, in my physique, with how I'm looking and everything like that, how I'm feeling, it's completely different. I feel so much better over the past few weeks. And it's, it, it's a nice feeling, you know, because for a while, I looked at myself in the mirror and I didn't like what I saw. So getting it done on days like this and training with people like Sai that are gonna push me a little bit more when I wouldn't have on my own, it's key, you know? And it's good because, to be honest, it's not that busy. It's almost like it's 35 degrees or something. I just see we take things very seriously here. Slow cream and chocolate boys cakes, man. We've got to get it in, innit? You know what I mean? How you, how you feeling? Good. You know what Good. I mean? One word. Getting it in, in that heat. A little bit of food. Chilling out, mellow. You know what I mean? Bye, One more. That's good. Oh. oh my. God. Like walking off a freaking plane. All right, quick pit stop at Asda. I'm actually gonna have a look at some barbecue stuff. You know, because we're dieting. Diet's going really well. Diet is actually going really well. Like I said a minute ago, I feel much better. Um, however, it's 36 degrees. It's going to be a nice cool evening by the time Ella actually gets home. We have a shower or whatever. I'm going to have a shower before she gets back actually, but I just fancy a barbecue to be honest. But if it's going to cost me 25 quid, I shall leave it. Man's skint at the minute. But if it's not, and it's a reasonable price, I'll pick the stuff up and surprise her. She's going to watch this and be disappointed if we don't have barbecue tonight. Never mind. <laughs> Unsurprisingly, we wound up having a barbecue. It was sick. It only cost about six quid. I think it was two pound fifty for the for the the barbecue. Um, burgers were like three three. Five, I don't know. It wasn't much anyway. So it was good. It was a nice little treat for the hottest day of the year so far. Today is actually even hotter. Today is Tuesday. Yesterday was Monday when we actually filmed that. It's pretty crazy. Um, I hope you guys have coped well enough. 
kind of. I hope you've managed in this heat. Um, if you trained, I hope you stayed safe because my God, I was definitely struggling the most, but I am a hot person, I'm a hot human. Anything above 10 degrees and I'm in shorts, it's like, you know. Regardless, I hope you guys have enjoyed the sun. I hope you guys have stayed out in the gardens if you have one. And more importantly, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, let me know by leaving a massive like, comment down below, subscribe if you are new. Let me know what you would like to see next. Not only stuff like this, I'm, I'm introducing new kind of content, you know, different challenges, train-like, food videos, which is highly, highly requested, so I'm glad you guys are enjoying all the content lately. Again, if you have not already and you're watching at this point in the video, 10 minutes in, come on, smash the like. It really, really helps the channel grow. I appreciate you all. Together we will grow, and I will see you beautiful people in the next one.